Welcome back everybody to another episode of Bill Hanna Baking. Today I'm going to show you how to make a sugar pie. If you've never heard of sugar pie before, it's a popular pie here in Canada, specifically in the province of Quebec and other French Canadian communities. So let's get started. You're going to need one pie crust. I already have my pie crust from the last video that I made. You can use a store bought, but I encourage you to make your own. Then you'll need half a cup of brown sugar. I'm actually going to use a mix between brown sugar and white sugar just because my brown sugar is super dark. You're also going to need a quarter cup of all-purpose flour, two tablespoons of cornstarch, one quarter teaspoon of salt, and one and a half cups of heavy cream, and finally half a cup of pure maple syrup. If you haven't already, make sure you're blind baking your crust before you get started. You can check out my last video on how to do that as well. Preheat your oven to 400 degrees Fahrenheit. You're going to focus on thickening up the mixture. So increase your heat to medium high or high just to get it thick. It may be thin at first, but that's why you're raising the temperature. The boiling will activate the cornstarch and flour to help it thicken. You'll notice mine didn't even boil that much, if any, but I did notice it start to thicken up, so that's when I realized it was done. Now you can pour the mixture into the prepared pie crust. If you followed my previous video, you have an additional pie crust to either add a top or create your own design. I'm also going to add a quick milk wash onto the pie crust that's exposed. What that'll do is it'll help it brown quicker in the oven. This is an optional step. You'll notice it will brown the pie a lot more than if you just left it without the wash. Now the pie is ready for the oven. Put it into a preheated oven at 400 degrees for about 35 to 40 minutes. You're looking for the pie crust to get to a color that you want, usually a golden to brown type of look. And that's it, you're done. Now you can dig into this delicious pie. This crust is so flaky and the sugar pie is awesome. I used some of the cream that was left over to make myself some whipped cream. And you know what, I'm not even normally a pie guy, but look at that. Hopefully you enjoyed the pie as much as I did. See you when I see ya.